Can I just tell you guys what a week it's been? New clients, 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 more clients. I am grateful for the clients. I'm starting to get nervous, you know, like... I've got five tomorrow, then I have work at four, which is good. So maybe if I keep up with all these clients, then I can quit Buffalo. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Um, I came straight home. That's not true. I did not come straight home from work. I had a grocery shop. I haven't been grocery shopping in like three or four weeks. So it's been interesting. I've gone to my food storage. Which is fine, but I gotta tell you, shelf-stable almond milk does not taste the same as from the fridge section almond milk. But my new favorite thing is the dark chocolate almond yogurt from... It's not so delicious. It's from Silk. Yeah, Silk. So, so, so good. So I found my poor professional. Oh my gosh, it was under my drawers for my Ikea drawers. I probably already told you this, but I'm so excited still. <laughs> also, uh, my house is a mess because I've had so many clients. I haven't had time to clean. I didn't even go to class yesterday. I could not wake up. I couldn't do my homework. It was terrible. So I didn't go to class yesterday. Wait, what's today? Friday? I didn't go to class today. Which is bad. There's only five homework problems and I didn't even do them. So rough. My room is turning into a mess. My Oh my gosh, isn't that beautiful? That jewelry chest right there. Oh, so beautiful. It's a mess. But yeah, my my sister wants her hair done and her hair is gonna cost retail, like if I was to charge somebody, it would cost like two hundred plus dollars because uh, her hair's pink and she wants it to be this beautiful jewel tone. <coughs> she has a real big thing for Ramona flowers right now, so she wants that color green. I don't want my phone not to be charging right now, so. Ooh. I wish I could cut and edit cool videos for you guys, but I'm just not there yet. Oh. Welcome to my zit. It's like over, but it's like there. It looks so hideous. Like, it looks like a permanent frown line. Gross. Ooh, I found a dollar shirt for my grandma at Walmart today. I find the cutest shirts for her at Walmart. They're like a dollar. I bought her two $5 sweaters too. And a box of chocolate. She's going to get hooked up tomorrow if I have time <laughs> to do her hair. I have a work meeting at 8.30 at Buffalo. Then I hope I get done. If I get done by 9, no, there's no way. Like, I can't do my grandma's hair until Deb is able to pick up Salem. So I have to go pick up Salem on the way to the work meeting. And then hopefully that's an hour. Then I have my dad's haircut at 10. Then I have uh, another haircut at 11. Actually, I have three haircuts at 11. <laughs> because these two out of town guys wanted their haircut. And I don't know if they're going to show up. And if they do, their hair's really going to be really easy and uh yeah and then I have my friend Kirsten uh she's gonna be there at 11 and then uh and then I have a, a another lady coming in at 12 30 so hopefully I will be able to get her done before 2 30 and then I will try to do my grandma's hair and then I will go to Buffalo and I will work because it's fight night right so today I went shopping I only had like blips here and there, so yeah. So here is my Walmart receipt. You know, I really get upset when Walmart doesn't mark their prices or when receipts don't mark adequately their, um, hold on just a second. I just feel like my camera can never focus. Like it doesn't focus correctly. I don't know. So I, I hate it when, um, receipts don't adequately mark uh, what the item actually is. So when you're trying to redeem it in coupons uh, or rebate apps, um, they they have no idea what it is because the receipt didn't mark it right. So hopefully everything's good. Look at all these coupons. Whoa, yeah, this is me. Coupons. I don't know. Let's see. My 
subtotal was 3044. That's not true. Come on. What? Well, this receipt doesn't tell you, like, ooh, you saved this much. It's not like Albertsons, but I had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten coupons. So that was awesome. Then, uh, this one is. No! This Walgreens one is really long. Like, I, I bought everything in the store long. How long is that? Like, two feet? Gosh, kids are born this long. Alright, so I bought everything on sale, and then I got filler items. But the filler items I got... I don't know if you guys know this. I'm a couponer. <laughs> Thanks to Des, who taught me when I got my food stamps taken away last summer. Because I decided to work a lot at the restaurant. Anyways, so I did a lot of filler items so I can use all the coupons that I had. Because I had 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 coupons. And then I had even more coupons on the app. Because that's where coupons really are at. I don't know if you guys know this. So coupons are on your Walgreens app. And the thing about Walgreens, Fred Meyers, Albertsons is that you're able to use um, a digital coupon on their app. Then you're able to use a paper coupon. So if you get the item on sale, you're able to use a paper coupon. You're able to use a digital coupon. You put in your phone number or you, swipe, you scan your card and it just comes off at checkout. <clears throat> and then you are uh, able to redeem uh, your these items too. Just say you bought pack of gum on sale like I did extra 79 cents and then you got a coupon for 25 cents off and then on uh, you got a digital coupon that was 25 cents off and then you got a rebate online from Ibotta or checkout 51 or whatever for another 25 cents I mean you're just at that point you're making money so then you save up this this money on these um apps and you're able to cash them in so I can I save them up and I cash them up uh, around Christmas time so I can buy myself buy myself a Christmas present. Uh, so I bought last year I bought my um, two palettes my Sinner and Saint and my Urban Decay Heavy Metals. I've been wanting to buy the Urban Decay Burnt palette or whatever it is but I know that the Heavy Metals wasn't going to stick around for a long time and I heard it complimented the Sinner and Saint palette really well and it does it's great. So, um, I can always buy that naked, um, burned palette or whatever it is later. The, all the reds. Because I love the reds. Alright, besides that Walgreens and that Walmart, Walmart, Walmart receipt, I went to Costco. I went to Costco with Salem and Walmart and Salem this afternoon. Should have went to Grandma and done her, did her hair, but... I miss Salem, you know? I don't get to see him a lot. Deb gets to see him mostly. He gets him from 3 to 8 every day when he's awake. I get him a couple hours in the morning. That's it. I take him overnight. And I snuggle him with him, snuggle with him for hours. Well, I have to do homework, so I snuggle with him for his... He just falls asleep right on my lap every day. So, here's an earlier Walmart receipt. And I think that is it. Oh, what? coupons come back next week to shop these offers whatever so I also bought because I was critically low on pee pads and I don't need the heavy duty ones like I bought you know I don't I for a long time I didn't know what the hell I was buying when it came to pee pads you know I see numbers I see contour fit like like uh, or it's a long fit or whatever fit and out or like some of these things were like some like diaper pads that you got from your mom in seventh grade or whatever when it was time for your cycle. So I realized I liked the Blue Poise package. And that wasn't on sale because it was... I got $5 off because I had the coupon. I had a coupon, um, paper coupon, and a Walgreens coupon on their app. And so I got $5 off. So basically these poise pad like were free they were 79 cents and unless there's an i a rebate offer online for my bought or check out 51 then they're free so i got i liked the blue ones and there was a level four so this one's a level three and there was 30 of them 
So I hope I like them. I like the blue ones so much, but I'll try the pink ones. And then these ones were on sale, super sale too. And these ones are 30, size 3, or level 3, whatever. Oh my gosh! Both times I went to Walgreens today, can I just tell you something? There's been some stinky people. Like, I saw a friend. I used to uh, work with her uh, at a job. Um, and then I used to be the secretary at that, at that place. And I worked with her. And, you know, whatever. You know, I saw her. And she just had, like, this I don't wash my clothes smell. Like, uh, when guys have, like, stink down there. You know, like, and it's, you smell it. Funk. That's what it is. It's like crotch funk. Yeah, that's what it smelled like. Oh, it was bad. And I just like, it was nice, you know. And then when I went to check out close to midnight, because Walmart here closes at midnight because of all the theft that they've been having overnight. The person that was on the checkout, the self-checkout, super nice. But he has not washed those pants. Maybe he's washing his body. But the pants are not being washed. And let me tell you, I mean, he stunk up that whole self-checkout area. And I just think I have a hypersensitive nose. I feel like sometimes I don't. I feel sometimes I don't smell anything. And then there's times where I just can't smell. I smell just everything. And there's times that oxygen just really just burns my nose. And I just can't. It hurts to breathe through my nose. So yeah, what else was I going to talk to you today? I had so many things. Oh, um, I don't think I clarified. So when I do my sister's hair, <laughs> let's go back. When I do my sister's hair, she uh, pays me back by housework and she's <laughs> way behind schedule. She has helped me. It takes her two, two hours to like clean this. All I gotta do, I have so many pedestals and little jars and little shelves and I'm gonna put that shelf right there and I put another shelf right there. And so I have like all these places for this stuff and she takes her like two hours or something because she can't, she can't put down the phone. She's addicted to the phone. It's crazy. Also, like I had her help me put my son's clothes away. My son is, we split, it's a big room and we have these doors that split. I love old houses, they're so cute. Anyways, um, she takes forever because she can't put the phone down. It's ridiculous. And then when you're like, Hannah, and she's like, what? What? What do you want? I want you to, I don't do your hair just because, you know, I just love spending a whole Saturday not taking any other clients and doing your hair with, so you can have a bad attitude. I do your hair because I love you and I respect and I expect the same level like I, 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 res I want respect back like I the thing she, she wants her hair from pink to green she wanted her hair from black to silver you see what I'm saying I don't know if you know because I'm a hairstylist and I know black to silver is black to white green and pink it's like green and red are on the opposite sides of the color wheel so if you have a hair color that's too red too warm too red red warm then you use green ashy tones to neutralize it white is on the opposite spectrum of silver black i mean that's just you've got a level one and you got a level 15 15 being the white black being the one I can't take your hair from blue black to silver, Hannah. I just can't do it, but I can do something. I'll lift, I'll lift you. I'll color and move, and I'll try to bleach, and we'll see where we can get. And I'll just tell you what color you can be. We turned her pink. Now she wants green. Pink and this bluey green neutralize each other, so I have to color strip her hair again. She's killing me. So help me. Help me not die, Hannah, and help me with my housework like you're supposed to do. Saturday night, you and your boyfriend come over here, put clothes away, do my chore list. I have a chore list. I've just been so busy with clients, I haven't been able to do it. Ooh, my pure romance lady called or wrote me and said that 
Uh, the rest of my stuff was ready to be picked up, which is cool because I got a new pheromone bug spray slash body oil, which I love. I need to make an appointment with my tax lady because I need to get those taxes to flowing. Student loans are running out and I need money. Although I'm doing really good at work and stuff, I just need to make sure I like to pay my rent way in advance, stuff like that. So yeah, oh my gosh, okay, can I just confess something? A lot of people know, so I mean a lot of my friends know. I consider my friends, oh, I hate when my pillows do this, my work friends, they're not just co-workers, they're like pals, some of them I've known for six years, my gosh, it's been such a long time, okay, I don't know what it is, but I think my son's father is still very attractive, I know I'm not attracted to him because I take these meds that cause weight gain and it's crazy because I stopped working out because I've been so busy with the with the clients and stuff like that and I've lost weight I don't understand that but I've lost like 10 pounds just trying to eat healthy but whatever and I see pictures of like my ex-boyfriend we were dating for like a bit last uh, a short bit about a year ago and I was like really mean I wasn't ready for a relationship I think I just really love being single I love doing my own thing I don't love somebody sitting around being lazy I like to go 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 I'm never like sitting even when I'm watching a movie at with somebody like at my parents house or whatever I'm doing like I'm couponing I'm writing a paper I'm I don't know what it is but I'm never just sitting there doing nothing and so I just I was just really mean to him I didn't want to be mean to him because I mean I liked him I just I don't know I was like a, I've never been like that before ever but I also wasn't on meds yet um so I've been on meds since Salem about last August so I've only been on meds wow not very long and um yeah I was just awful so I told him I'm like just wait till I get on meds like everything will be fine like and he's just kind of well, it didn't work out. But I saw a picture of him. I can see pictures of him. And I think he looks great. I mean, he's so... I liked him a lot. Like, I thought he was like it. Because he has these three beautiful kids. And he's LDS. And he's alternative. And... But there's so much baby mama drama. And he wasn't ready to confront it. And such. So kind of stinks anyways whatever so yeah I see these pictures or I, I see my ex almost every day my ex Salem's dad I'm just like Ugh. I hate that I think you're attractive because I hate you have to hate a lot of things you know or else you're just gonna start getting back into the swing of things and you gotta remember like things just to help you not get sucked back in right like oh he'll never stop working at Jimmy John's which isn't a bad thing but it's just like I went to school to become a chemist like how would that work I don't know or uh oh like he smokes in the car and my son gets croup all the time and he gets sick all the time because he's always getting um, and, uh, like he's always getting sick because of the smoke everywhere or he got a DUI with my son in a car when he was six months old like, stuff like that you, you just have to keep thinking about that stuff because if you're like oh don't answer the door with your shirt off you douche yeah so yeah or like Sean like it's a good thing because he has so much baby mama drama that it just was never ending and so if I just think about that kind of stuff, I'll be fine. 
I have really good looking friends. I do. I think they're cute. I crush on them. Like I, I, I love all my friends. I love all my girlfriends. I love all my guy friends. Uh, so I have so many attractive friends, but alas, I just love being single too much. I've been thinking about um, calling one of my old girl girl pals and like taking her out on a date because we had a really good connection and we had fun so I've been thinking about her more than most but I'm going to tell you ever since I gained this weight like the 20-30 pounds from the meds like I have not been feeling confident about myself so I don't know whatever maybe she doesn't either I'm out, guys, for tonight. I have a work meeting in a few hours, and I need to get some sleep so I can wake up because the meds are about to put me out. Just like probably some takedowns tomorrow at UFC. Ooh, never ending. All right. Bye, guys.